Hello everyone, welcome to our presentation. Um, this presentation will focus on a summary and a comparison between the characters in the Lost World book and movie. So with no further ado, let's dive in. In the Lost World, there are some characters that only appear in movie or book or both. Here are some characters that appear in both. The first one is Edward Malone. He is the main character of this fiction. He is a kind and reasonable person, but sometimes he is a fool. He is the main reason why Challenger wants to go to the, to the Lost World again. The next one is the policeman. He is the one who asks Malone whether he wants to charge Sing Challenger for attacking him or not, and Malone, and Malone should know. The next one is Mr. Henry. He is a good friend of Malone. He is the one who gave the translation letter and attended the class with Malone. The next one is Mr. Warden. He is the head of the lecture that Challenger and Malone attend. He didn't, he didn't believe what Challenger, what Challenger said and made fun of it. In the, in the end of the story, when the education group came back and kept the evidence to him, he said it is unbelievable until he saw a terrible tale. He had no choice but to believe it. Oh! The next one is the Airmen. They are the antagonists of this story. They try to kill the education group. They have their own language. They fight against the Akala type and lost. When someone is the Akala type, they are a good type that help the exploration group fighting against the ape men. The, the ship named Malala help the exploration group leave the part to her. Professor Josh Challenger he is loud, large, physical, impulsive, and violent. Challenger lives up to his name by challenging nearly everyone he encounters. He succeeds in proving the entire scientific community in London wrong, and he has the security and intelligence to be a hydrogen balloon from swamp gas and dinosaur gas, Professor Summerlee. Professor Summerlee at first appeared to be the weakest member of the expedition, but Marlon soon comes to appreciate his power of endurance. Summerlee's slow in the novel is largely a for to Professor Challenger. In fact, he agrees to go on the adventure for the sole reason that he wants the pleasure of seeing it fail. Mabin White. Mabin White isn't a technically major character in the novel for his death before the narrative even begins. He is the first to discover the lost world. Mac Adele. He is the one Marlon met to request a time for him for a lie, so he sent Marlon to interview Professor Challenger. Professor Lono Murray is the chairman for proceeding and he made laugh about Professor Challenger's claims. We join. native and there are no names mentioned in the book. Generalized from the fact that the movie was based on the book, we can assume that the plot or the characters would be the same, right? But that was not the case. Uh, focusing on the character part, there are correct characters like Sir George and Dr. James or etc. who are less important, they are just cut off the movie. But that is no doubt. But at the same time, there are characters like Lady Sangerton and Lord John Roxton who are far more important. They were just cut off from the movie too. Why was that the case? We will explain later in the movie section. In Doyle's book, Edward loves Lady Sangerton. But if you are not as dumb as Malone, you will see that she doesn't love him at all. As you can see from the phrase, he would be a harder, sterner man, not so ready to adapt himself to a silly girl's whim. But, above all, he must be a man who could do, who could act, who could look death in the face and have no fear of him. A man of great deeds and strange experiences. This seems like an impossible task for Malone, but he still tries to do it. It's pitiful to see how much Edward one-sidedly loves her. He will name the lake he found after her. She doesn't care at all. She will marry some random guy when Edward finally did all the condition she gave. Roxton is the auto volunteer Dan Malone in the Lost World expedition. He has the personality of a leader more than Professor Somebody does, even the books give him a role as the leader of this expedition group. This can be easily seen in the situation that Gomez betrayed his team and put off them in danger. He still managed to stay calm and order Pujo to kill Gomez. Another situation 
is when the ape man caught all of them. He was able to overcome his fear and cooperate with Malone till the rescue plan was successful. There are several different scenarios when it comes to comparing the Lost World book to its movie. Therefore, to be able to distinguish between them, we shall first look into some examples of original events that occurred in the book and then compare it with some significant changes in the movie that slightly altered the storyline. So the first event here is that in the book, Gomez, a local guide, betrays the expedition party. The act of treachery is explained by the fact that Roxon had killed Gomez's brother on a previous expedition to the Amazon. The second event is that the native tribe joins forces uh, with the well-armed expedition and they slaughter or enslave nearly all of the ape men. This event in the book made the characters fight a moral dilemma. Um, the third event is that while investigating the wonders of the lost world, Roxton takes great interest in nearby blue clay deposits. It was later revealed that the blue clay contained diamonds, making the four main characters extremely wealthy. According to the book section, some of the vital characters were excluded from the movie. But by far, that doesn't make the story incomplete, because some of the new ones were brought in to fulfill the story. Jenny, Nielsen, and Malu are the two women that were added to the original story that previously have zero to non-female characters. And additionally, there is Jim, the kid that just came out of nowhere in the movie, and he also acts in many important incidents, such as substituting what Lord John did in the book when helping the team out of the aim in hand. And to conclude, in our opinion, the cutting off and repressing characters makes the movie still thorough throughout the short amount of time that the movie had and even makes it more interesting for kids and women too. That's it. But in the movie, Edward doesn't have any relationship with any girls. He just wants to be famous by taking the adventurous assignment from his company, the Daily Gazette. Jane is also a volunteer out of the Malone, but her role in this team is a bit diminished than Roxton. Maybe it's because of women's rights in 1990s, so her role is only just an observer and photographer. Even Guide Malu has more screen time than her. In other words, she is absolutely an extra character. While Roxton doesn't appear in the movie, so Challenger is the one who killed Gomez's brother on his previous journey instead. Another difference to note is that Gomez isn't a local in the movie, but instead a Portuguese. While in the movie, the ape men's leader is killed and the two tribes reunite, thus there is no moral questions raised. While in the movie, as mentioned early, earlier, Roxton doesn't appear in the movie, Thus, the blue clay contain containing diamonds wasn't brought up anywhere. The main characters seemed to remain in their financial statuses before the expedition.